penthouses were born in 1920s in New York City when there was a construction boom and people designed these luxury apartments on top of buildings with views to die for. Today, we are in a penthouse which is 7,556 square feet, which is 702 square meters in Beverly Hill. Welcome back to another episode of Walkthrough with the Janies. Today, we're here to show you something really spectacular. We're talking about a two-story penthouse that looks like a bungalow in the sky with beautiful views all around. It's approximately 7,556 square feet, which translates to roughly 702 square meters. We are here in Beverly Hill. No, we're not talking about Beverly Hills in California. We're talking about Beverly Hills here in Grange Road, Singapore, District 10. Stepping out of the private lift, what immediately greets you here is this massive double volume ceiling, very grandeur type lobby. So this is like a private lobby. It steps out into this area where you have this spectacular powder room hidden over here. And you can see this front here. This is basically two levels, but on this level, it is more of the entertainment area. So you can see there's two separate living areas we have a beautiful spiral staircase in the center, which really looks like an art piece. Now come this way, take a look at how great this space is. So you've got your living here, you've got a step out balcony. Obviously, if you have guests, they can step out here for a cigar after they have the dinner. Over here, you've got this dining area where you step up to the dining. And as you can see, the kitchen is divided into two sections. So this is the gourmet section. So we've got a marble top, stainless steel backsplash. So this part is basically where you do your light cooking. And you can see we've got all the appliances. We've got the dishwasher here, coffee maker. We've got the oven. We've got a steam oven here, another oven here, plate warmer. And to the back is actually where you have a full wet kitchen, as well as there's a separate helper's room with the helper's quarters and the bathroom attached. So coming back out to the living room, you can once again see the massiveness of this space. You've got two very nice living areas. I just love the space here. The amount of light here is absolutely amazing. And this staircase is actually like an art piece because it's in the center. It's a spiral, very light structure because of the glass combination with the marble and the wooden banisters is really a great art piece. Here on this level, this is the utilitarian part of the apartment. So we have three bedrooms on this level. There's a fourth bedroom on top and all these bedrooms basically come with their own ensuite bathrooms, great parquet floors. And you can see from the size of this bed, these are massive bedrooms and they all come with very elegantly finished bathrooms. I just love the simplicity of it. And this bedroom actually has a connecting door right here, which connects you so you can actually combine these two rooms into one if you wanted to. Let's take a look at the second bedroom again. Look at the size of it, it's massive. You can have a bed, a piano, and still space to spare. Lots of built-in wardrobes. There's a very nice walk-in bathroom. Now the third bedroom here, we can't show you for privacy reasons, but you can imagine the grandeur of it because it's right there in the corner. So obviously it's got the beautiful corner views. It's got a walk-in closet and it has a very grand bathroom as well. 
Let's head up upstairs. So again, I really love how they did this staircase. Hi, Sharon. Hi. Wow. What's up here? Welcome to the entertainment area of the apartment. So on this floor, which is half the size of the entire apartment, you have everything here to entertain your guests with. Starting off, over here we have this very beautifully done up bar counter and it's all in marble. It's very, very white beautiful. Marble. Yes, white marble. And what's nice here, you have a dumb waiter lift. So when you have guests over and you have food prepared in the kitchen, instead of coming up the spiral staircase, you can use this and present it to your guests in a faster way. And what I like here is actually behind here, you have neatly tucked away your laundry room. Your laundry room also has a back ex exit for those uh, people who are coming for service, such as uh, your gardener, they can come in from that door as well. So everything is neatly tucked behind and look at this, this view. Oh my goodness. It's like a postcard. This is actually part of your space as well. It's a huge swimming pool. We're not talking about a jacuzzi. It you is can a actually huge swim laps. pool. And it is pretty deep on this side, I can see from the reflection. You can actually dive here. So it's a very, very nice touch here. I mean, it's 360 degrees of beauty over here. Every single part of this apartment is just really simply stunning. You have a very nice entertainment area, outdoor entertainment area here. I actually don't see uh, why you would actually use the facilities of the condo because everything is here like when you have your guests you can actually entertain them outside or inside if you wish to easily 50 people yes it is a really nice space and look at all the views we have across you are actually facing the entire grange road area so you do see a lot of nice view. i like how they did the curved glass here it's a very nice touch and all the clear glass so that brings a lot of light so you can enter from here you can enter from this side so i'll be taking you from the other side so you have this very nice entrance on the opposite side and on this side, you actually have a proper entertainment room here where you can actually use it for karaoke or movie theatre. It is so beautiful. Look at this. You have speakers, you have a very nice huge projector screen here. You can close it off and you have a theatre room in your house. Blackout curtains here, but without the blackout curtains, you've got a stunning view of Clifton and One Tree Hill from this side. Yeah, and this room actually even comes with a powder room as well. So you do have a toilet here. So if your guests need to use the bathroom, they can just pop in, in the entertainment area. You do have one more bedroom over on this side. So let's take you into the bedroom. You have three at the first floor and this is the fourth bedroom here. So it is a very sizable, huge bedroom, very nicely done up as well. Very nice window size for an apartment of this age. You do have plenty of natural light coming into the apartment as well. And a very, very lovely done up bathroom. Let me show you the bathroom. See, even walking around takes a bit of time. Travertine marble in the bathroom. This is one of my favorite finishes for bathrooms. Very nicely done up. You do have a window as well for natural ventilation. So this is the bedroom on this floor. You do have a bedroom, entertainment room, very nice outdoor entertainment. Actually, if you want to, you can repurpose this into a room as well. And the nice thing here is all the air conditioning is ducted. Yeah, so you have a total of um, six rooms in that sense where uh, one is a study. So this is actually a study as well. So you have a study and entertainment and four bedrooms in total. So what's nice about this study area, if you can see, is actually a sliding 90 degree sliding door and it's frameless. So if you don't want to enclose the space, you can open it up and you have a really nice big indoor entertainment area as well. So your guests can sit all around here if they want to or they can choose to sit outside. So I really like this design. This entertainment area is really nice. When you're doing your work, you have this beautiful swimming pool view. So let's head out again. It's really a great entertainment space. Yeah, I really like it. And it's not very hot standing outside because yeah. you do this, have this. This part is also sheltered. Yeah, it's really nice and very well thought of. So if I were to ask you, what are some of the things you find really, really like, wow, or stunning in this penthouse apartment? Leave it in the comment section below. 
What do you like about this apartment? What is the actual wow factor that you would look for in a penthouse? Leave it in the comment section below. If you want a private tour, just click around the link around this video. Give any one of us a call. I'm Richard. I'm Sharon. We, we are, are the, the Janies, and, and we'll, we'll see, see you on, on the, the next, next one. one. So why did they call this Beverly Hill? Um, I'm guessing because in during the 80s, was it all?